Hello everyone, I'm Gaurav here from Logic Cubes and in this video we are going to take a look uh, over decision making. Okay, we were uh, continuing through the operators, right? But beca uh, because uh, for the further operators we need a bit knowledge about decision making statements like if else statement. So here in this video we are going to take a look uh, about a very simple, very simple if else statement that is a decision making statement for C. Okay, actually the decision uh, making statements are the real assets for the intelligent system or intelligent programs, right? Because of the capability of uh, making decisions is the right thing about the uh, pro any program. Okay, so uh, here we are, uh, we are going to take a look over a decision making statement. I, I just in short, I write that DM statement. Okay, that is if else statement in C, right? So uh, we are going to take a look about the de uh, decision making statement. But first of all, let me tell you what is, is the decision making statement here. The decision making is a very general term. If suppose uh, a, a boy went to a shop to buy something, or uh, he went to buy a chocolate there, uh, like a dairy milk or anything else. Okay. So uh, if he don't get that dairy milk, then at that point of time. He has to make uh, or he has to make a decision or decide whether to take to, uh, chocolate from the shop or to change the shop or to take another uh, chocolate from there. Okay, so th uh, this is a very fundamental thing about decision making in uh, every programming language, and that is the logic behind every decision making statement in any kind of programming language. Okay, so uh, first of all, let us say uh, from we are going to program here a very uh, basic decision making uh, program that is uh, whether checking if the number is bigger than a particular value or not okay so that we will get a basic idea about the decision making so let uh, let us start now say uh, int a is equals to we give the value of int as 23 let's say okay uh, and so terminate it so now the value, uh, value of this variable a is 23 and we are going to check if the value of a is bigger than 25 then do something and if not then do something okay so it is as simple as we say like if now if is a kind of uh, decision making statement or you can say as we added the parenthesis uh, function but it also gets some assets here so we can directly write it as if this followed by parenthesis do something okay if something that is the argument if something then do this else do this okay we can further go and add uh, some similar if statements as a nested if or ladder if but i wanted to discuss this more deeply in my further lectures okay so first of all we are going to this very basic uh, if else statement so uh, first of all come to come here and if this is if something if some argument agrees that we say if a is less than 25 okay so uh, then we wanted to print we wanted to print a message that we wanted to print a message that this is a low value let's say okay so uh, we are using an argument this simply says as as we spoke like if a is less than 23 yes a is less than 25 uh, sorry a is less than 25 it is 23 then print this okay so in this case this is going to print now if a is less uh, more than 25 let's say uh, it's 43 okay then what is going to do then it is going to print this value except except of this value so it is a high value let's say okay so this is a basic very basic if else statement here and you can learn or you can proceed through this only with other operators so uh, here it is if a is less than 25 else this okay so right now we are going to check this uh, program first so compile uh, save it and then compile okay compilation is good and then produce the output so here it says this value is high of course we know that the 43 is greater than 25 so the answer will be this value uh, this is a high value okay 
So let's test it for the low value. Let's say uh, it's 223 and then compile it and then again tell the console, call the console. So this is a low value. Okay, yes, this is the low value then 25. If in case let's test key, uh, if is it equal to uh, 25, then what happens? Okay, so in that case we can use another if statement after this else. So we can say if is a is equal to 25 okay if a is equal to 25 then we can do like this okay so uh, basically we are not going to use right now we are the relation operator we are just simply going to use uh, such things okay so uh, in the relation operator we use it like this if a equals equals 25 then print this is a this is the exact value exact value so uh, let's give it as 25 and say okay print control f9 and control f10 so this says this is the exact value so this is how we use a simple if else statement okay and again if you wanted to uh, show something like uh, if it is not even uh, even not smaller than 25 and not equals to 25 just like the earlier thing we did so you can write it like this it is a high value. Fine. So in this case, uh, in this program, you can test it, it for the three way. Okay. So uh, let's change it and change to 55 or something like this. Okay. And now test it. Oops. What's this? Okay. The termination point as I said, I missed it. So now it is give that is a high hue. Okay. I miss it again. High value. Okay, see. Okay, my insert is on. And this closes here. So control F9 and control 10. And this is a high value. Correct? So this is how we use a very simple, very basic if else statement. This pattern of if else statement is uh, the three way if else statement. We can use this for checking grades and so and so other uh, other than that we are going to discuss this if else statement in our further lectures uh, very clearly about the nested if the ladder if and other types of usage of if and else statement okay so th that's for uh, that's all for this uh, particular lecture we are going to use operators now uh, the relational and logical operators from the next uh, very next lecture okay so uh, till then please like subscribe and share this video and do subscribe please subscribe and don't forget to subscribe so that it will be a, a bit of support for us to continue making our videos thank you